Howdy diggers, I'm back here at the 1939 church just doing a quick hunt and uh, got my first signal, been here 10 minutes and it's a weedy. It's about six inches deep. I don't know, it might be 40s or 50s. I'll have to uh, clean it up when I get home. On to the okay, next. Okay, been here 20 minutes and just got my uh, second good signal and it's another wheat penny. Looks like, I don't know, 1950 something. It was only yeah, four inches deep, so uh, on to the next. Hey diggers, just found a licensed chauffeur's badge, 1933. Must have been a fob because it's got this little attachment here. But that is a cool relic. All right, on to the next. Okay, just got another weedy about uh, five or six inches down, and this one's pretty green, so uh, it might be a little bit older. But uh, that's third weedy tonight. On to the next. Okay, diggers, I'm home, and I've got my finds cleaned up. I had uh, three short hunts this week, two of them at uh, two different churches, and one at a uh, high school for a short time, and I did pretty good in the collad department wound up with a total of 87 coins, $5.58 total. Takes my uh, 2010 coin total, $165.38. One of the churches that I hunted was built in 1948, and, and I did pretty good there. I got this uh, cheap chain. <laughs> I thought it was gold because it rang up in the gold range, but it's just junk. And uh, I got a copper bangle. I did get one silver ring. It's a signet ring. It says sterling in it. It's a pretty nice little ring. This uh, rang up exactly like a quarter. And I popped it out and I could tell right away it wasn't a quarter. <laughs> so uh, that was my best find of the week was this uh, nice ring. It's, it's pretty heavy too. Did real good on wheat scents today. Here's that oldest one. It's kind of green, 1910, 44, 49, 50. I got three 52s and a 55. I got this uh, limousine, or limousine, chauffeur pin, 1933, but it's for the state of Maine, and it took a lawnmower whack sometime in the past. So I guess got to wonder how a chauffeur license from Maine wound up all the way down here in Illinois found a very old bullet I don't know if it's a like a Civil War bullet or from the 1800s or 1900s but it sure has a white patina on it and it's got that uh, like hollow base so if any of you have any ideas let me know and uh, got a woggle I think that's the fourth one I found this year well, that's a nice one, Bobcat. I haven't got one of those before. And I found this kid's ring. And it's um, Pro Football Hall of Fame, Canton, Ohio. Uh, it's just a little cheapy. Alright, well, um, thanks for watching my video. Good luck on your hunts. Look forward to seeing your videos. Happy hunting. On, on.